Hello friends and how are you all today? The question says evaluate integral 1 upon 3 plus 2 sin x plus cos x dx. So here let i be equal to integral 1 upon 3 plus 2 sin x plus cos x dx. Now here if we put tan x by 2 equal to t we have one upon two secant square x by two dx equal to d t that implies the value of dx is equal to 2 dt upon 1 plus t square since secant square x by 2 can be written as 1 plus tan square x by 2 that will be 1 plus t square. So therefore we have i equal to integral now in place of dx we have 2 dt divided by 1 plus t square upon 3 plus 2 into sin x can be written as 2t upon 1 plus t square isn't it plus cos x can be written as 1 minus t square upon 1 plus t square. So now let us solve it further. We have i equal to integral 2 dt upon 1 plus t square upon taking 1 plus t square common. We have 3 into 1 plus t square plus 4t plus 1 minus t square. 1 plus t square will get cancelled out and we are left with i equal to, let us take out this 2 which is a constant out of the integral. We have dt upon 3 plus 3t square plus 4t plus 1 minus t square. We have opened the bracket. i is equal to 2 integral dt upon 3 plus 1 gives us 4 plus 3t square minus t square gives us 2t square plus 4t. On taking out two common from the denominator we are left with dt upon t square plus 2t plus 2. Now here if we have t plus 1 the whole square that will give us t square plus 1 plus 2t. That means we will have another 1 remaining over here. So we will add it to it. And now We know that integral dt upon t square plus 1 can be written as tan inverse t plus c. So here we have tan inverse, here we have t that is t plus 1 plus c. And now substitute back the value of t. We took it as tan x by 2 plus 1 plus c. So the required answer to the given question is tan inverse 1 plus tan x by 2 plus c. Right. 
So this completes the session. Hope you understood it well and enjoyed it too. Have a nice day ahead.